This is not your grandfather's potato field. It's very hard to find somebody picking potatoes now. Uh, it has gone mechanical harvest for the most part. Today, mechanical and chemical technology is involved in every part of the potato production process. It's a process and industry that brings in over $500 million in sales and employs over 6,000 people in Maine. And many of those workers that may have once been pulling potatoes from the dirt are now behind the gears of high-tech equipment. It's not just showing up to work and turning wrenches and, and, and going and working in the fields anymore. It's a lot of book work and it's a lot of just studying. I've probably got 40 or 50 hours just of reading manuals to be able to run some of this computer equipment. High tech has come to potatoes. Farmers are now looking at the younger generation to fill the void in an industry that consumes 46,000 acres of Maine land. The younger generation almost has to be here now. Uh, people that have grown up with it, it's a lot easier to do. I mean, if you're used to a typewriter and somebody puts an iPhone in your hand, it's kind of hard to just adapt to that immediately. People in their 20s and 30s, uh, they adopted this technology a lot quicker than the older generation. And uh, it's important that we have young people coming into ag because we need their knowledge. However, the majority of farmers I spoke to say the younger generation just isn't showing the same level of interest in getting involved in agriculture. Uh, I think there's a big change within the last 10 years plus of uh, people that weren't born and raised in it uh, not sticking with it. I think it is a different generation than when I came up through. And I don't know if you let the kids out, if they would be tough enough now to even hack it, to be honest with you.